Hello everyone and welcome to today's video. This is a different start than usual. It's a little more casual because I just filmed a video. Or did I film a short? I filmed a video. And it takes forever to put all my lights up and et cetera, et cetera. And I last minute decided to film this video. It's later in the afternoon and I just don't want to set everything up again. But I really want to film it. So I figured let's do a little something different, right? Why not? I hope you can hear me well because I'm using a different camera at the moment. I'm going to try a hair product out today. Now, this is the product that I saw on, I think, I want to say Instagram. I want to say Instagram. And I purchased it. I've tried this brand before. The brand is Wow. And I never saw this one. And I've liked their products a lot in the past. But this is actually for curls. So is, they, the other one I tried a long time ago is for curls as well. But I never saw this one. I'm a little worried because it's a light liquid, but I'm excited. This is called Curl Shook. I'm just like really curious to try it. That's why I'm doing this video. Um, it says Mix Plus Fix Bundling Spray. Bundled, frizz-free, glossy, no crunch curls. Weightless formula, hold without cap. Shake it up for glossy, defined, frizz-free curls that will leave your hair shook. One part of this unique formula contains Hemisqualine, there's that word, another new word for me. I'm not a scientist. Uh, oh, squalene, which is a natural alternative to silicon. Jojoba, I know that's good. Rice bran, rice bran, good. Passion flower, good. And grapeseed oils, wonderful. Plus our proprietary Profaxil 18 complex to smooth silken and defrizz. Creating epic, flexible, crunch free curls. Let's see. So it has a spray bottle. I have to still shower. Today's Valentine's Day. So we're going out to dinner. We have not gone out to dinner on Valentine's Day in close to 30 years. And I mean that. Like we went out when we were dating. Maybe when we first got married, but we decided so early in that we will never do this again because the service was so bad. I mean, I'm going back a long time. I'm sure things are much better, but then the kids came along and I kind of made it Valentine's about them and us. We had our own, so we just stayed home and I always like cooked dinner and that was kind of our Valentine's. Even like when we're alone and as the kids got older, it was just like, even though I cook every night, it was more special. We put candles on and you know, it was fun. But he's like, let's go out. So, okay, we're going out. We're going locally, nothing exciting, nothing fancy. But, you know, I thought it'd be a good time to try this. Oh God, and you know, it, it's at the, it's, I don't care if it comes out horrible, which I don't think it will, but I don't care as much because, you know, it's just him and I going out to dinner. But I will say, even though my hair is up, don't be fooled. I have a clip here because I cut my hair really short and I just realized I haven't done a video since my hair cut. It's short. But it's cute, I think. I don't know. I like it. It's my IX to go short because it just grows so fast and I know that I'm gonna love it in like a couple weeks. And sometimes it's just what you gotta do. Yeah, even though my hair is curly and stuff, it's just really short. So let's get on with it. Let's get on with it. I'm gonna go take a shower and uh, we'll go in my bathroom after. Okay, I'll be right back. So I thought I would go over something with you because I feel like it's not enough for a full video. Definitely a short if I like it. But um, let's just, I have seen this ad all over. And it's like, all right, let's just, I'm just gonna tell you what it is. Jones Road uh, Miracle Bomb. I'm sure you've seen it. By Bobby Brown. So here we go. I bought this because I'm like, miracle. How miracle can this be, really? So I went on, I finally said I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna get on the website and I am gonna say one thing. I'm also um, referring to my hair product that we're reviewing today. Oh no, I don't have my microphone in, hold on. All these products, all these products I'm getting lately, hair products, makeup products, they're expensive. So I wanna start looking at more like drugstore next. I feel like I've been spending a lot of money and I have another hair product that someone 
um, suggested because they can get it in Europe, I believe. I was like, oh, okay, I'll try, because I want to do, I want to review products that all of you are able to get your hands on. I didn't realize, I always thought like, oh, don't we just all go on Amazon? But I, I realize that's so different everywhere now. So, um, that product was so expensive too. So after, yeah, I'm gonna start looking at the drugstore stuff next, coming up. But anyway, Jones Road Miracle Bomb. Miracle? I don't know. Why is it considered a miracle? I did the online to see, I, I have no idea what, what is this? I don't know what it is. I don't know what color to get. So I did the online quiz, I guess you could say. I did that and this is what I came up with. Um, tawny, the color, the color or whatever, tawny. I don't really know how to use this, but apparently you can use it for everything. Let me go on the web. Let me just check it out. How to use. Break the top surface of the bomb with your index finger first, and then warm it up to soften the formula. Apply bomb using your fingertips, palms, a brush, or a sponge onto cheeks, lips, or any way you want to tint or glow. Not intended for the eyes or eyelids. I did already kind of go like that, but I think you gotta really dig in there. So let's just dig in there. <laughs> it's kinda, it's nice. Okay, is that dug enough you think? Like is this color gonna be on my face? I'm a little concerned. Um, but this is the color match that it came up with for me, so. Oh wait, I think I'm supposed to go like this more. Cause it is a little more tackier than like a moisturizer. I don't think it's for people who have really oily skin. I have pretty much normal skin. It does feel nice, it does look nice. I don't know that it's worth so much money, but you know what, let's see and continue with our makeup. It did give me a tint, it didn't like, it's for a very natural look, so it's not gonna cover all these sunspots, etc. So that's why I'm gonna go in with my makeup and um, I'll do my makeup and we'll come back. And then we gotta do this hair product, so I'll be back. I'm in the bathroom and color wow curl shook I'm excited so what do I have uh, for best results shake well to combine so there's two there's a mix and a fix bundling spray mix and fix apply to wet hair my hair is gonna be damp saturate hair thoroughly including under layers of curls to evenly distribute air dry or dry using a diffuser. Now, for some reason, <laughs> when I did the first curl video, I don't know, people were like, you did it wrong, you don't listen to directions. Like it did. But they were getting confused between the curl one and the straight hair one. I think that's what the problem was. And the curl one, I, I forgot what it was called, dream coat maybe? I loved it when I put it in. I loved it, but it didn't last in my hair because it just, I just needed a little extra something else, like a cream or something, that was all. But like, woo, no need to get angry. So I always do my hair, like it says, use wet hair. Okay, here I am. Look how short my hair is, guys. All right, I'm, I, my hair is damp. It's not considered wet, but now I have to put a ton of this in. So gonna be soaking wet and I don't like extra moisture in my hair it's just not good for it I know okay here we go let me see what it is put it in my hand first okay yeah I mean typical Woo. I'm not a fan of sprays it's just I feel awkward it's me I'm, I just I, I 
Am I awkward? I'm a lefty, but I don't know. I just feel like it's so hard to put sprays in my hair. I don't know why. Because like now I have to use my thumb. I'm not a fan of the spray, but if it's really thin, I get it. What's your choice? Am I the only one? That's like awkward with the sprayer. Should I put more in? Put a little more in. It's pretty saturated. Yeah, I mean, I don't, again, my hair is so short, so I'm kind of just doing this and I'm putting my head forward. So I'm still working on it. I kind of have like the style to stay home, the style to go out, I'm a wilder style. Going in. Okay, it is done and styled. What do you think? It feels great. I can play with it because I can tell that it's not going to come out. Yeah, I mean, my curls look great. They feel great. Definitely no crunch. They make my hair feel soft, lightweight, which I like. It, it's weird. It's like it almost changes the texture. I know that another color wow did that to me. Um, I have very coarse hair, and I have a lot of it. So for me, if I had added like a thicker cream, just a little bit on top of this, it would be better for me or underneath it, whatever. But it would be better for me because I have that, I just have that type of hair. So there's a lot of flyaways for me, like frizzy ones. And I, I, I know if I'm gonna use a liquid, that's how it's gonna go, no matter what. And I could even feel it on the bottle. It definitely has, um, not greasy, clearly. You can see it's not greasy, but that's about the shine in there, right? I definitely felt it on my hands when I was crunching my hair out. Not that I needed to, but I always crunch my hair out. Because even if you, if it's not hard in your hair, that water, just it's it's setting, it's that curl setting, and once you crunch it, it becomes a soft, beautiful, dry curl. So always, always do that. It Trust me, you'll, you'll be surprised. If you have long hair, you can just like put it in a ponytail and twist it, the same thing. Anyway, so, yeah, I mean, I really like it, but again, when you have hair like me, you just need a little more of a thicker product, but I love this. I think it's great. My hair feels really, really soft and really lightweight, so I am really liking this. Oh, that's what I was going to say. When I was crunching my hair out, I was like, oh, it felt greasy. I was envisioning like a VO5 look, like when I was a little girl, that's what my mother would put in my hair because that's literally all we had, which is pretty much like petroleum jelly, literally in your hair and I just would have this shiny that was when we cut my hair we I say we because I feel like I had no say in it but I went from like down to my back to this short and imagine I'm not even gonna go there but I am gonna do that one day I'm gonna show you how if I brush this out this is basically what I look like <laughs> I saw I'm gonna go a little off topic I saw a TikTok video inst whatever it was a real this girl had beautiful curly hair, long, beautiful curly hair. And they're like, do it. You know that video, do it, don't do it, just do it. Just, you know, the background. And she took a brush and she brushed her curls out and she looked great and she was emphasizing like, yeah, this is what I want. And I'm like, seriously? Like, it took me all these years to finally get nice curls and the after is what I literally looked like growing up, literally. Now we have to decide it's popular? Like, no, no, maybe a little in between. That's actually why I think this is a good product because I think that the perfect curl, um, that's not really what we want as much anymore. We kind of want this sort of messier, a little bit of frizzy. I'm not brushing my curls out though. I'm not going that far, sorry. Not to, after all these years, I'm not going back to that. I'm not. But, I think this is more like coming back as far as more of like a messier look, more natural. Not like such a banana curl that's perfect. So this is the now product for curls, right? I guess now that I determined that after saying all of that, I realized I like it then. All right. I'm in the now. I'm in 
the now. I don't have to have perfectly defined curls. Although I always liked it, but you know what? This is the look. Messier. I could do that. I'm sure a lot of us can do that. All right, guys, I did like this product. I'm going to go out to dinner. I can't promise you that I'm going to check in. I can't, but I'm going to try. In case I don't do it, I still want to say goodbye to you guys. So I'm doing this now, and it'll be an alternate ending when I edit. Okay? <laughs> Have a good night. Enjoy your day, and I'll see you in the next video.